Enough is enough. Previously on the Papa Bay Show, Papa Bay beat a kid named Mojo to advance to the semifinals. After the reveal of the mysterious text, would another defeat be imminent for Papa Bay? That was a clear win for Papa Bay's Roar. Sometimes, it's just the breaks of the game. Respect to Papa Bay's opponent as he was able to go on this deep run without using drift. Bravo! Papa Bay's opponent this time is a kid named Ewell. Note that this was a same speed match. Ewell's roar was about to stop completely, but the collision restarted its spin, but in the opposite direction. Notice how it's now spinning right. There was a confusion at first, but the judge was able to sort it out in the end. Okay, one, two, three, show, babe. I'm speaking, sir. Okay, right. Are ready? Three, two, one, go, shoot. That was a clear win for UL's world. Papa Bay's vanish was changed to high mode. This was very close but the added height of Vanish in high mode made a difference. Ewell 
Ewell's vanish was changed to high mode. And when Mobius falls, it's all over for Papa Bay's world. Papa Bay's third straight finals loss. The first one is to Sir Gilbert. The second one is to this very smart mother Vato who Papa Bay credits for the prominence over bearing dash combo. The third one is obviously to UL. Whether this loss was a consequence of beating Mojo earlier or the work of the Beyblade Illuminati who sent Papa Bay the threatening text yesterday or both. One thing is for certain, Papa B is sick and tired of a third straight LeBron James finish in his last three finals appearances. <laughs> <laughs> 